my channel today I have why did I say welcome back this could be your first time here if it is hello I'm Sarah you should subscribe that'd mean the world to me <laughs> or thumbs this up either one works whatever you want to do but regardless today I am doing my Lush haul I filmed one last year and y'all really seemed to like it a lot so I thought I would film it again this year after I did my yearly Lush crawl through like I usually only go once a year because let's be real the prices are kind of expensive <laughs> So I wanted to share with y'all the things I picked up. I will be putting on the screen somewhere up here if it's a new product or not so you'll know if it's like limited or different than previous years. And I will also be describing them or like giving the description that they give on the website so you know what it does. And I'll link them all down below if you're curious and want to see the prices or want to buy one for yourself. You should. They're amazing. So yeah, I feel like that's enough rambling. Let's get started. So starting off in no particular order, the first one is this one, and it is Stardust, and then the description of it is... Follow the star all the way to the bathroom. It will bear exotic gifts of fair trade Ugandan vanilla from the mountains of the moon, and precious rosewood from the depths of the Peruvian rainforest. A twinkling dip in the starlit waters gives a powerful boost to the mind and body. Ideal for a little post-party recovery. So this is basically for after you party all night long for New Year's or something, I guess. I'm not really sure. But it smells really good and it was one of their new ones. So I really wanted to try it out. And it's getting dust all over I me. Mean, this is just the beginning. <laughs> The next one I did try out last year and I loved it so I picked it up again this year and it is the Butter Bear and it is so cute. I'm obsessed with anything bear and like woodland animals. I don't know why. It's just weird. I can't explain it. Molded into a friendly bear, this bath bomb has a generous helping of cocoa butter to give you the softest bear hug imaginable. It's great for nourishing and protecting the skin no matter how long you stay in the tub and has the same vanilla fragrance as our butter bath bomb. The comforting aroma will even linger softly on your skin long after the bath. This little guy is great. He actually does soften your skin. I loved that about him last year. That's why I picked him up again. And it's just great. It doesn't just make your bath look cute. It also does something good to your skin. Actually, I don't think he does anything to your bath. It kind of just dissolves. But I still like him. <laughs> He's cute. I also got the Candy Mountain because you can't not go there and buy Candy Mountain. I love it because it adds a little bit of glitter and shimmer to your bath without being big chunks that you have to clean up after. It's just, I love glitter, obviously, and it's just nice that you don't have to clean it up. It's just great. So the description for this guy is... Fair trade vanilla grows in view of the Zari Mountains of the Moon in western Uganda before being packed into this lustrous pink bubbler. Crumble it under running water and sink deep into the glistening ridges of sweet scented bubbles and comforting candy scent. It's a sweet treat you won't soon forget. Candy Mountain is definitely one of my favorites. I'll probably be repurchasing this until they don't sell it anymore, so I would recommend checking out this one. If you want to just check out one of them and you don't know which one to buy, I would recommend this because it's just all around a great product. This next one is probably like my favorite looking one from this year. It is so cute and oh my god is it glittery. <laughs> this is the Magic of Christmas Bubble Bar and it is on a cute little cinnamon stick and it's got a bell and a ribbon and so much glitter. I haven't used one of their products that have glitter in it so I'm not quite sure how that's gonna go but I'll let you know on Twitter or Instagram if it's like incredibly difficult to remove from the bathtub. But the description of this guy is Foam alone, stir up a whole lot of Christmas magic with this warm cinnamon stick. It's packed with a punch of cinnamon leaf and fair trade organic clove to warm up your skin while fast forwarding you straight into the festive season. Treat Grinch like moments by holding the spicy bubble bar wand under running water and slipping into a blanket of hot almond bubbles. He does smell a lot like cinnamon. I can, I can, it's very zesty. It smells like orange and like cinnamon kind of mixed together. And it looks extremely cute. I'm not really sure what they have in the middle. Probably like some kind of cinnamon thing. I don't know. Seems to be the theme. But it's just so cute. It's so cute. And it's got glitter everywhere. This is the Luxury Lash Pudding Bath Balm. And it smells really great. I haven't used it before. But I can only imagine how colorful it's going to make the bathtub. I'm really excited. And it's so cute because it's got all the colors. And then right on top, it's got a little, like, Christmassy leaf. I don't even know what those are called. It looks kind of like holly, but I'm not really sure. <laughs> but anyways, the description of this is... 
Catch 40 winks of Christmas Eve with lands of sleepy foam and comforting lavender. Tonka absolutely provides a perfect Christmas dessert for your skin while reassuring scents of lavender oil and creamy benzoin resinoid banish tension and aid relaxation. Soothing for excited children and grown-ups alike. It really does have a great scent. I do like it a lot. I'm very curious how it's going to change my bath water. I'm sure I could look it up somewhere and see it happen, but I'm just going to wait and let the suspense build up. I also picked up Yog Nog, and this scent, I would smell it before you buy it because my boyfriend did not like the way it smelled. I do for some reason. I'm not sure if it's just like a weird thing, but I like it. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you what the description of this one is. Sweeter than dipping into a cookie jar, this luxurious balm is sure to warm you up cold. Frosty evenings. Spicy clove bud oil stimulates the senses while soy milk powder and organic shea butter create creamy, comforting waters. Luxuriate in comforting toffee soaks with clouds of gold and a touch of luster. I'm really excited to try this out. It's set. It's supposed to make it like a golden touch. I don't know if that means it's going to make the bath golden looking, which I would personally love. Like, who doesn't want a gold bath? But I don't know. I'll definitely have to let y'all know on Instagram or Twitter. I also picked up this Twilight Bath Bomb. I'm pretty sure this one's all year round. I really just wanted it because I've seen so many cool Instagram pics or like Tumblr pics where it's like your bath looks like the starry night sky and I'm pretty sure this is the one that does it. There's like two night sky ones that are could do that to your bath so I kind of just gambled and got this one. I'll go ahead and tell you what the description is. Recreate the magic of a starry night in your bath water with this cloud of lavender and tonka absolute to fight the demons of insomnia and soothe your stressed out body and mind. Our most relaxing bath bomb yet, Twilight is our gentle, reassuring hug for the bath to transform you from worn out to warm and fuzzy. It changes colors like the sky at dusk. From pink to purple and dark still, lay back in the comforting herbal waters to soak up your troubles far, far away. You can definitely smell the lavender. I'm really excited to try this guy out and see what he does to my bath. I'm so excited. <laughs> the last one I picked up was this little guy. Well, he's not little. He's actually quite big. And this is the Golden Wonder. It is, it smells like sweet tarts. I'm so excited to use it and it makes a little bit of a rattling noise so that kind of makes me wonder like what's gonna happen in the tub whenever I put it in. But the description online is Fancy and uplifting cocktail, cognac and zesty lime oil get this bath party started with mood brightening scents while sweet orange oils refresh the senses. In the water this present shaped fizzer unwraps itself to reveal glittering gold luster and sparkling turquoise explosions. Don't wait until Christmas Day to bathe yourself in festive luxury. I'm really excited to put this in my tub. I remember last year I saw them use this in like one of their big tub things that they have at Lush and it made the bath look so cool. It, I think it looked green. I could be having issues with my color eyesight but it had like cool like swirls with like sparkles and stuff in it so I'm really excited to see what this guy does for me personally because you know it would make sense because I think there's blue inside and yellow. Blue and yellow make green. Well that's all I bought from Lush this time. Please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and want me to film another one next year because I'm probably going to do that. I just love these so much. So be sure to subscribe if you have not already. I post new videos every Saturday at 12 o'clock central time. So yeah, I'll see you all next Saturday. That was kind of weird, but we're just going to go with it. Bye. Got bath bomb stuff all over my pants now.